uh, welcome dear all in our youtube channel alexis projects and today we'll see a new model the title name is iot based multiple tank level monitoring system using load cell so monitoring setup is as on your screen so first of all we will discuss about the components we are using so first we will see it is the main switch it is used to turn on and off the entire project okay specification you can see on the left side and uh, the second component is here it uh, you can see it is a wide nut connector used to supply the power okay and the third component uh, is you can see it is a push button it is used to tear the load cells to zero okay as you can understand and uh, the second next part is uh, you can see it is a black buzzer when tank level is less than 10 percent it will uh, continuously blow to give the indication okay and the next component is it is 16 cross 2 lcd it is used to display uh, both the uh, tank level and its weight okay and it is uh, of the port to control the uh, lcd brightness next component is uh, it is the brain of system it is actually node mcu asp8266 and it is responsible to handle the entire operation of this model handling the wi-fi credential running the sensors lcd etc all the things next component is uh, uh, you can see it is actually a signal amplifier it is used it is a compulsory when you are using a load cell because load cell signal is very low so it is used to amplify so that our uh, microcontroller can read it easily okay and uh, the next component uh, is uh, uh, it is actually a power adapter yes. uh, next component is uh, as you can see it is actually a load cell of around 20 kg maximum load load capacity and uh, this one is for a bigger tank okay and the next uh, load cell is for the smaller tank and its capacity is also 20 kg but uh, we, we will measure uh, on this uh, uh, only around 2 to 3 kg okay so let's uh, provide power supply for the operation of the model so we are connecting to 230 volt power supply okay after power supply we will need to connect our model to wi-fi so for this we will use our mobile phone so hotspot so you can use any device like wi-fi router or mobile hotspot so first uh, we will need to configure uh, its uh, wi-fi hotspot okay so as you can see we will need to enter uh, the, uh, the name wi-fi name entered inside the code okay and then after we will enter the password to connect with the Wi-Fi connectivity so password we have entered okay so after uh, uh, configuring we will need to turn on the hotspot and then after connecting to uh, our device will show here connected device will show here okay so now it's time to visit uh, IoT server for this we will uh, use uh, Chrome browser okay you can use any browser and type here add a fruit IO as you can see on the screen and just uh, press the enter and click on the first website adapfruit.io.com okay so page is taking uh, loading loading the page and within one to two seconds uh, it will load so as you can see we have, website, uh, we have visited the website and after visiting you will need to first log in here okay using your credentials and then after uh, you will need to go to uh, click on the IO button okay then click on the dashboard so after clicking on the dashboard you will need to see, you will see your project name here okay so after clicking on the uh, dashboard name you will see here is our main monitoring setup okay so now it is uh, final uh, finally it is time to to test our model how it is performing okay so first we will turn it on using the main switch so as you can see model name is appearing on the LCD okay and remember uh, when uh, whenever we place uh, any kind of low uh, uh, water level into the tank it will take 10 seconds to uh, get a uh, refresh okay and you can see buzzer is glowing because tank is empty it means tank is empty means it is less than 10 percent so we will need to fill the water to the tank so that buzzer should turn off okay remember for both of the tanks we are uh, set set uh, max minimum water level is 10 percent okay so as you can see we are filling the water inside the tank black one, uh, one is a bigger tank and second is a smaller tank 
okay when uh, uh, level will reach to more than 10 percent buzzer will automatically turn off so as you can see uh, new uh, readings on the history so new readings are uh, for tank 2 is 25 percent and tank t1 is 37 percent remember tank t1 is a bigger tank okay and uh, tank 2 is a smaller tank so as you can see it is t1 and a smaller one is t2 and uh, you can we can see all the readings at the same time live on the iot server at a food iot server you can also match the readings okay you, as you can see on lcd t1 is 37 and t2 is 25 uh, same you can see 25 and 30 say, uh, 36 uh, means uh, that is uh, nearly equal to same and you can see it is a uh, weight uh, in kg kilograms okay on left side it is showing the weight in of tank and on left side it is showing the percentage of water available inside the tank so again uh, increasing the amount of water inside the tank to take the new readings so we have added some amount of water in both of the tanks and let's see new readings so previous reading was 37 and 25 now it is showing 40 and 48 okay bigger one is 40 yes and smaller one is 40 percent and at the same time you can see live data on iot server it is showing exact same readings so it means our model is working so fine you can see our readings on the lcd on left side it is showing gamma uh, weight into kg and on right side it is showing percentage of water first percentage of tank uh, okay again adding some amount of water take for further readings adding amount of water in small tank then on bigger tank and again we will see new readings so value should be increased see smaller tank is 51 percent and bigger tank is 59 percent and it is weight in kg and at the same time you can see on iot server so it means our model is working very well very nice and remember refresh rate is uh, 10 second you know one time it will refresh in within 10 second okay at the same time you can see uh, value showing and graph is also drawing on the uh, laptop screen in a very friendly person who want to purchase this model please visit this description box okay so thank you so much for watching the video we will see you in the next video take care